Why is it that in Australia, 1,902 coffee cups are thrown out every minute? Why is it that Australian households create 1.3 tonnes of plastic packaging waste every minute? Why is it that this year alone Australia has produced nearly 1.4 tonnes of e-waste, including phones, laptops, computers, toasters and tablets, every minute? Why is it that globally we create 4,400 tonnes of landfill every single minute? It's all because of money, isn't it? You see, big businesses and the government discovered it, and they're still loving it, but you can't tell they're happy about it because they try and smother it, counting each dollar while they uncover it and stack it in their money pits, but if they actually looked up from their money-covered desks and took a look at the Great Barrier Reef, Great Australian Bite, clean soil, trees, beaches, seas and wildlife, they would realise that there's almost nothing left. So since the government aren't with us, let's force them to make a change. Let's petition to transition into reducing our emissions, on a mission to protect our forests, for a rest, no way. Not until the day we stop the Adani coal mine. Yeah, the government really crossed the line. But there's still time for polluting our oceans to be banned. So while we keep going with that fight, let's demand our supermarkets to get rid of this horrible plastic packaging on our food. Let's protest. It will test our skills. But there's still plenty of hope for saving our planet. So let's plan it. Let's plan a date on when our younger generations are going to know that they'll be able to see sea life in our oceans. Poetry in motion? I guess you could call it that. Just as long as we end this natural habitat erosion. Yes, you've been chosen to take back this filthy, greedy potion on our earth. Because money is nothing to what our home is really worth. And that's a fact. And yes, lots of us positively react to the impact of climate change, but it's how the majority of us act behind our backs that leaves us two steps forward and one step back. But if we work together, we can stop them in their tracks. So are you with me? Are you with me on rewriting our laws? Are you with me on protecting our shores and ocean floors? Are you with me on saying no more to plastic bags, cups and straws? Because if we do that, Maybe we can turn these climate change problems around. Let's stand together, stand for better, and use this people power to make the minutes count. Authorised by D. Rowe, Greenpeace, Australia Pacific, Sydney.